Kia ora te whanau, Grant Uthorn back again with another quick language lesson for you and starting in te reo Māori. Now, over the last couple of weeks, we've sort of been looking at commands, how we can tell people to do things, how we can give instructions to people. So I thought today it would be a great time to look at how we can give negative commands. What I mean by that is when we ask someone to stand, we might also want to say, don't stand. Or if we tell someone to sit, how do we say don't sit? Or don't play with that, don't do that, versus do this, do that. So today we're going to look at how to negate commands. Very simple to do, shouldn't be a long lesson, but really effective for your language learning. So let's jump across to the screencast and check it out. So in our commands the other day, we looked at things like e noho, to sit, um, e tu, to stand, um, what else did we look at? Um, e peke, was to jump. So, really simple way that we can negate all these things and negate any commands really, is we add a little word at the front called K-A-U-A, kaua, 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 kaua. So, kaua e noho, don't sit. Koa e tu. Don't stand. Now, if you've got kids, um, this might be a really common one that you might say a lot. Koa e tutu. You probably know what that means. Um, don't be. What's the right translation? Mischievous, 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 something like that. Um, Another really common one is koa e pena. So pena means uh, to be like. It kind of means like to be like. So it's kind of like saying, um, don't be like that. So that might not be something specific that you're talking about or something, something specific that you're trying to instruct your child not to do or your spouse or whoever. Um, so you can say koa e pena. So don't be like that. Don't do that thing. Um, Koa e haere, don't go. And so really it's just any of these commands that you can, and I don't need to list them all there, but you can go through these, make this part of your language learning exercise. Go and find some commands and just use that really simple structure. Koa e, and then the command, that's how to negate that command. So let me know how you go with it down in the comments. If you're checking this out on YouTube, definitely hit the subscribe button so you can check out all the new videos that are coming out. We'll see you later.